So you can see the five zones here. We've kind of got a, a central valley, the Vale of Eternal Blossoms. Um, we've got dungeons across all the different zones. Um, I'm going to talk a little bit about two of these zones, uh, the Jade Forest, which is our intro, our start zone, and then the Valley of the Four Winds there on the south side. Um, one thing that's cool is we've really been working on this for a while, so we've got a lot of stuff to show you guys. I think this is probably the first BlizzCon we're going to be able to actually show uh, video fly-throughs of these zones with their, you know, art complete and ready to see. Um, here's a little look at the scale. Um, so there's Twilight Highlands from Cataclysm. So you can just get a vibe for how big these zones are. Um, yes, we're, we're delivering five zones, but they're, they're very, really large zones. And when you add that to the fact that you're not going to have access to a flying mount till max level, you can really see there's going to be a ton of content in these zones. Here's a look at uh, some concept art of the turtle. Like I said, it's, it's a turtle. Um, so you can see there's a, there's a valley you start in and you kind of work your way around. We've got a really cool storyline here where you're trying to restore some spirits to that central temple. Um, this is the map. Um, so this entire uh, play space, the entire starting zone is playable here at the show on the show floor. So you'll be able to go over, get a Pandaren, and play all the way through. Um, that's why we have a final map here because uh, this whole thing's playable now at the show. Um, here's some screenshots of a look. This is that central temple you saw. This is a look at the edge of the turtle so you can kind of see the, where the turtle hits the ocean there. Uh, obviously, Pandaren loved beer, so they need lots of breweries. You'll, you'll find these all over the place. And then this is a great shot showing the actual, you know, the island itself that you're playing on. You're on the back of a turtle. So when we say you're on the back of a turtle, we're not trying to fake it and kind of just look like a turtle. This actually is a turtle that you're playing on. When you run up to the edge, you'll be able to see water on the edge. You'll be able to see the head. Everything will be animated. So it's going to feel really cool and unique. And here's a video of uh, some of what it looks like. kind of brown dots are the spires throughout the zone so it's filled with valleys all across um, here's a look at some concept art just looks so great it's got that super unique vibe another look at some of the valleys with those spires and then we've got a video I'll show you guys And then the southern side is all the coastal jungle. Here's a look at some concepts. So this is our, so when we were trying to think about what Pandaren farmland would be, we didn't want it to feel anything like the farmland you've seen in WoW, like you see in Westfall or you've seen in other zones where we do human farmlands. We wanted to feel different and have that vibe. See, so we've got those tiered rice paddies. Um, this is a side cutaway view of the zone, so you can kind of see how it starts and then teeters all the way down to the coastal jungle down on the edge. And here's a video, see what it looks like. <laughs> 